afternoon, Internet. We are finally back in St. Petersburg and finally stationed at our home and not traveling. I know I really shouldn't be complaining too much because Charles has been traveling for like, I don't even know how many months straight. Yeah, pretty much it feels like three months straight. And I've only been traveling for like a week. But my voice is going. I'm tired. But I'm really happy that we did playlists and we went to New York and did Tribeca. It was a lot of fun. We met a lot of amazing people. And I am still kind of getting accustomed to this whole lifestyle and uh, to playlists and meeting all of you guys But I have to tell you that it was so much fun and we appreciate you so much and You know to all of you that we saw and to all of you that we did not meet We love you. Thank you so much for watching and that's how I'm gonna start this video off As it seems every freaking day, there's something wrong with these damn things. So I've been calling all morning to see who could possibly come help fix this thing. I'm getting really, I'm honestly, I've never been more frustrated with something in my entire life. Everything else I've been ever able to actually figure out what's going on. For some reason or another, I cannot figure this damn thing out. Because now look, everything looks all sad and wilting, pissed off. I guess when all else fails and the machines let you down, do it yourself. Damn machines. This is ridiculous. Look at this. Everything's dying. All the, all the work that we put into all this stuff is now dying. So frustrating. <laughs> Having some trouble over there? Yeah. Typically I drive when we go and do anything during the day. And I said, nope, I drove way too much this past weekend. So Caitlin's driving and we're trying to get to this uh, place to go have lunch. Cause she's all, the tra all the construction that they're doing in Tampa, it's literally on GPS. It's like it hasn't been updated yet. So every single time it tells you to go a certain way, it's like there's a roadblock there. So you're actually getting screwed because it's not taking you the right way. So guys, if you ever come to Tampa, just watch out for that uh, road work. Don't go to Tampa. Never follow maps. Never follow Google Maps. Never follow Google Maps. You just gotta learn how to get the new route. Yeah, well. Obviously, they're behind on that, and they're not what really the giving us the best, the best route to, to get anywhere. On the interstate, now why am I U-turning? This is ridiculous. Happy Monday afternoon. Go. I like my gummy go, go bears. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> you are beautiful, Caitlin. You're beautiful. Thanks. Let's do this right then. It's always nice when we get home. We can just do this and kind of chill, relax, you know, expand our brains. If you guys are brand new to the videos, I don't know if you guys know, I can't drive. Come on. Due to a, a medical condition. So this is my only form of like getting anywhere and kind of driving, I guess if you will. And to be completely honest, it's more fun anyway. So we are back home, obviously you know this because I've been saying it all day. Um, false for me about traveling is the fact that you have to unpack when you come home. And I have a big issue with doing that, but guess what? Today, I accomplished that task, got all of my packing undone, and usually it looks like our house has had a tornado that has gone through it, a bomb has gone off something awful and it's not that bad because I've tried to clean up just a little bit it's still getting a little bit better but Charles was even surprised I never unpack crazy thing is with Australia I didn't fully unpack from I didn't fully unpack from Australia until just before I went to New York that's how bad it was that's how bad I am at doing this uh oh what the hell's going on here why golf carts are more fun because you can just do things like that. <laughs> Obeying the laws of the road. <laughs> I've got to say the past, I guess it's been two months now, 
have been pretty freaking crazy. We did uh, New Zealand, then we did Australia, then we did the whole tour, you know. Then we went home, we went to Tribeca, then we went to Playlist. All within, I think, like two months. So as you can imagine, I'm pretty exhausted with traveling. And I think this weekend we have another show. And then we gotta get ready for Warp Tour, which is, what, two or three more months? And it's been a lot of traveling, but the cool thing is that as I'm traveling all over the place, I keep hearing our song on the radio, which is Black Cat, ABD, I know, which is probably the coolest thing ever for me. Because I've never had a song that I've been a part of on the radio, so this is the first time it's ever happened. And as you can imagine, it's, it's such a surreal and amazing thing. It's so cool that you guys keep shazamming it and taking screenshots and all that stuff and sending it to me because a lot of times I don't actually get to hear it, which is funny because I don't have, I don't usually listen to the radio. I know that sounds stupid, but I don't. It's so nice to just be home for a little bit and hang out with the pups, drive around in the golf cart and just sleep in my own bed, eat home cooked meals, which don't, I mean, who am I kidding? It's just always gonna be home cooked pizzas. Little things that make you feel so much better. There's only so much, you know, hotel stuff that you could actually do before you go a little bit crazy. I spent all that time watering this stupid lawn and now it's gonna rain. Of course. I'm trying to find Charles. What are you doing? Reading You're reading from the trash can? <laughs> okay, so just just FYI, this is recyclable. But I'm just kind of wondering why you don't have it out and you're just reading it. Because I didn't want to touch the trash. You're such a dork. I don't want to touch it. What is he doing? I don't want to touch it. Have you noticed today that your ability to speak is kind of altered? I'm just tired as hell. Right I, that's now. my point. Mine has been, I've been trying to say things. And I'm like, God, I don't even make sense right now. I'll give you all of these. I'll give you all my shoes. I'll give you my cute little heeled. Wedges. I'll give you oh, my booties and my sketches. Oh, we gotta. I'll give you all. Of this has gotta get done. This is why we can't have a pool. Look at this. Oh, cool. Good job, honey. I'm glad you saved one. That's so nice. You know, now just imagine if we had the pool, though. It would be like 14 times worse. I know. This. this is this was us testing. Whoa! Why do you have to go this way? Because the beetle's right there. Yeah, but one. Oh, that so. Would be the purpose of saving the beetle. Right. Is that a oh, you just killed the beetle. No, he's over here. You killed him. Oh, shoot. You killed the beetle. You just killed the beetle. You killed the beetle. It's not dead. Did you, do you feel the shame? I put him away. He's you feel the shame? Shut up. Marley, which door are you in? Hey. This one? Nope. This one? Oh, there you are. Quit doing that. We're so cute. We were just putting dishes away together. Now we're loading the dishwasher together. This is such an exciting romantic moment in our relationship. There's one thing <laughs> I hate more. Dirty dishes? The dirt, no, dishes that sit in the sink. Here's the thing though. I was running this this morning. I didn't wash those yet. I apologize. Are we seriously fighting? I think we're, I think we're fighting. I think this is our first You caught it guys. This is the first time we're actually gonna, we're gonna fight on camera. I think we need to put that camera away because something's gonna happen. You know what? You know what? We just did an epic, so epic of a trip to the store that it was so fast. Couldn't you bring the camera out? It was that epic. After you returned, you are like this, like. In and out. Is it Flash? Is that who it is? Like. Yeah. Flash. Doing pretty good. Ali saw Iceman, uh, by the way, at Tribeca when we were doing all those interviews. He was like in the hallway. Did we say it? I kept making like, eye contact because I think he knew that I knew who he was, but I didn't want to do that person. I think he just watches the videos. Oh, he does. That's Iceman. Who, he was. who are we kidding? He was like fan -filling. He was like, I know her. Who, yeah, who are we kidding? Iceman watches these videos, totally. <laughs> Iceman, how's it going? You were actually my favorite X-Man. Uh, so we should hang out and talk. Why don't you start painting more so that way you have more paintings around the house? I know, I was thinking about that and I went and looked at paintings today. We have those canvases in the house. I, I know, but I was trying to find inspiration. Inspira guys, give her inspiration in the comments. Tell her something that she should paint other than me. I think I should, you should be, uh, paint a giant portrait of me. Or you can get a rug. These are the ones the robot doesn't like though. I know, I hate your stupid robot. Our robot makes sure that dog fur is gone every day. Every time we wake up, there is no dog fur. It's the best robot I've ever met. I beat a lot of robots. 
I love this store because they always have one of these random ass sections of clearance. So you can get grapes. Oh, look at this. You can get a container, a container with no lid. Seashell lady. Okay. A grass rabbit. Oh, dried strawberries. Okay, that makes sense. We're driving home and look at this storm cloud. It's incredible. There's definitely going to be a wicked thunderstorm today. I don't even know, that looks kind of scary. Doesn't that right there actually look like it might be the start of a tornado? You guys see the road? Looks like it's on Ooh. fire. No, this is like the start of a scary movie. Wrong That's how hot turn. it was. That is so spooky, I love it. Let's watch a scary movie. Allie just made healthy chicken nuggets. Mm. No condensed crappiness in there. No. I was gonna put red uh, red pepper, like cayenne pepper in there, but I didn't know if it was gonna be too hot, so I didn't do it. I lucked out. She loves to cook, so that means I don't have to all the time. But you cook, you are a really good cook though. I know. I, wish, I remember when you, when you first kind of like started dating, and maybe orange chicken or... Yeah, sesame chicken. Yeah, and it yeah, made a sense. <laughs> Dick. So it's this is like it the like provides me this sense of like calm. It's the power couple thing. Like you can make food and it's awesome, and then when you don't want to, I'll make food. Mm -hmm. It's a win-win. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, you crack me up, dude. All right, internet, we are heading off to bed. Char's in the shower, and we're gonna go watch a scary movie. Well, I'm gonna force him to watch a scary movie. But if you guys are brand new, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you guys have been around and hanging out and you like the video and you wanna keep liking the video, hit that thumbs up. And I, and Char, and Zoe, and Marley, and Diesel, tomorrow. We love you, good night, we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Yes. Why, why don't you have your Coachella thing on? Oh, okay. So I'm going to have Coachella. Oh, I want to be in Coachella. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, six years. Hey, man, look. I'm like a Snapchat filter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>